Craig Cohen 87 here for episode 132 of the Iron Dead. Alrighty, so I got a pretty big week to follow up since last week was incredible. I beat every, what would you call it, baseline, every benchmark I had. I moved the needle on my hack squats, my leg press, my, my dumbbell presses for my chest. Um, just about everything I had to do, I did. So, you know, it'll be kind of exciting to see if I can hit this again. What's happening here? Yeah, I'm driving a rental car and ugh, I hate getting used to a new car. It's annoying as fuck. Pissing me off. I just, ugh, I prefer my own car, but what are you gonna do? So yeah, so today is gonna be a chest day. Um, what did I do last time? So, am I going up? Yes, I believe I'm going up. So I was doing 115 dumbbells, or was I doing 120? No, I was doing 115 dumbbells, and I think I got, I got 13 reps. I'll have to go check the book. But if that was the case, then I'll be moving up to 120s. I feel very strong. I'm, I'm actually pretty heavy. I woke up at 242.2, uh, and I went to bed last night over 250. That was the first time that's ever happened. So I'm very heavy. My uh, my coach seems to think I'm a little too heavy, a little too fat. Of course, relative to bodybuilding for the show that I'm entering. And uh, you know, ne you never want to get too fat because the, the heavier you get, that's not muscle, the longer you're gonna have to spend cutting down. And uh, the longer you spend cutting, the more time you need, uh, the less flat room there is for making mistakes, and you risk losing more muscle that way. So I'm gonna be cutting my calories probably by about 500 a day from where I was, but keep in mind I was in a big surplus. I was about 4,300 and change, and now I'm gonna be going to about 3,900 and change. So I just started it, so it's kind of weird. I don't know all the numbers off by heart. I have to keep looking at my phone. You know, that's why I like eating the same thing every single day, like every single day. Because once I memorize it, I don't need to, to look back at what I need. I memorize all my meals off by heart, how much of every ingredient, how much rice, how much beef, how much avocado, how much maple syrup, how much rice, cream of rice, everything, you know? And now I'm like, uh-oh, because he's changed a lot of the numbers around, so now I gotta memorize it. Okay. So that'll take me, you know, about a week. Probably less than that, but I'm just saying at least a week, probably. Well, probably, yeah, at least a week. Not more than a week, I should say. But, uh, yeah. Also, today is my last day of my vacation. I go back to work tomorrow. It's been a little over two weeks because I had Labor Day added to the end of it. So I'm actually happy to be getting back into a routine. Although it's nice to be able to wake up whenever you want, which I've been doing. Other than that, I, I like being busy at work. I find I just, I do nothing when I'm not at work. I just stay at home and I'm on my computer. I listen to music. I watch Dragon Ball Z over and over and over again. I'm not uh, the most productive human being out there. I think I cleaned my house twice. I did a bunch of laundry. But, uh, yeah, that's about it. I didn't travel anywhere. I'm not, uh, I like being at home. I'm kind of introverted that way. But, uh, yeah, no, I'll be looking forward to getting out. Waking up at 7.30 every morning, promptly. It'll be difficult the first night. But I'm thinking every other, and it'll be difficult the first morning, but every other morning it'll be nice and easy. Because I'll be, uh, my, 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 my biological, or whatever you want to call it, the clock, that'll be set very fast, won't take very long. But uh, yeah, that's all there is to say about that. Of course, chest day is my favorite, so I'm really looking forward to uh, kicking ass, taking names. And I know if I can do really well this week, that sets me up good for all my other workouts, you know, just psychologically, just because I love doing chest so much. So, I mean, there's there's no body part I'm more passionate about. Although being passionate about it hasn't helped me grow an incredible chest. Although my chest is better now than it's ever been. Um, yeah, so that's about it, really nothing more to say. Uh, I should be at the gym in, let's see, 28 minutes. And that's where I will see you. All right, first exercise of the day. It's gonna be 115 pound dumbbells. I got a little carried away. 
with the 120s. I was only at 110, so I'm gonna go up to 115. I got this for 13 last week, and the rep range is 10 to 12. So anything double digits is good. If I hit 12, I'll go up again. Let's see how it goes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, Ten. One more. Eleven. I think I got another one in me. Got it. Nailed it. Eighty-five pound dumbbells. Ten or better. Let's do this shit. One. Ooh. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Slow negative. Oh yeah. 80 pound dumbbells, I got it for 13 last week. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna beat it right now. Let's do this shit. Ooh. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, slow. I don't know how I shattered it, but I shattered it. Set number two, down to 60 pounders. I got this for 13. Let's shatter that baby. Compared to that 115, these feel super light, even though I'm on an incline now. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That's it. I still beat it by one. Ooh, yeah, I felt that one. First set, time for some decline flies. I'm going to go with the same weight, 60 pound dumbbells. I think I got 12 last set last week. So let's try to beat that. Ooh. All the way down, cross. There we go. One.
I don't want to press it. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Uh, one more. Uh, woo, pretty good. All right. Second set. I just double checked for last week's numbers. I got 60 for 10. So I actually beat it by three reps. So I'm going to stay with 60s. Let's do this shit. At least 10. One. Three. Four. Five. Yes. Eleven. Eight. Nine. One more. Ten. Woo. Set number three. Down to 45 pounds. I want 15. <sighs> Oh, yeah. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Starting to burn. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. One more. Oh, yeah. Very good. Whew. I'll be moving up in weight next week. Set number one of two. I'm going to go with body weight for the first set. I feel really good, and I think I can hit ten excellent quality sets. Let's do this shit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, yeah. Second set. Really happy with the first set. I'm going to go with minus 50 and see if I can get 10 to 15. Let's do this shit. All the way down. That's the most important thing. 
Now lock out. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. I'm going like that. Hitting the finger. Eight. Nine. Ten. One more. I got it at me. Eleven. Twelve. I'll take that. Pretty good. Let's go do some. Uh... Is it available? Perfect. Peck deck. Set number one. 130 pounds. I want to beat the nine I did last week. Let's see how this goes. One. Six. Ooh, it's gonna be harder than I thought. Seven. Slow. Oh yeah. All right. Second set. Down to a hundred pounds. I got this for ten last week. And the reason I'm lifting my ass off the seat is so I can emphasize as much of the lower peck as possible. Oof. One. Two. Three. Four. Seven. One more. Ah. Woo, I beat it. Third and final set. Down. I'm going to keep doing with the 100 again. I'm going to try to hit 10. Might get a little ugly, but ugly means failure. Failure is ugly. And productive. Oh, yeah. <sighs> One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, pretty good.
Alrighty, let's recap that wonderful chest workout where I kind of destroyed what I did last week. It's crazy because last week I destroyed what I did the week previous. So this is like third week in a row. Third, sorry. My, one of my fingers got out angled over there. This is one of my my third week where it's looking really good and the weight was light. I couldn't believe how light the 80s were on the first set of the incline bench press. I, I did 17. I only needed to do 15 to move up and I got 13 last week, so I beat it by four. And you know what? The only thing I can think of is doing those, those, uh, what would you call it? Um, my decline flies with the dumbbells has made my chest stronger in a way that it wasn't strong at all before. So even though the lower pec is not as important to lifting weight, I had very little development. I have a lot of room to grow. So I think that's why it's been so productive. But you know what? I'm also very heavy. I'm well over 240. I went to bed at 250 last night. I'm heavier than I've ever been. And uh, a lot of that's muscle. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of that's fat too, but that's going to happen. But you know, I'm you know, I, I don't I don't I'm not super fat. I just got to make sure that I don't get too fat. That's that's what what the cutting back the calories is for. It's not because I'm too fat. It's to, to make sure I stay where I am and I don't get too far ahead of myself because it could happen, right? And you're better off uh, having some calories to work with than being right up against the wall. So, and I also I've been off for two weeks. So I've been sitting around doing, not working nearly as much, you know? So I haven't been burning as many calories. Back to work tomorrow. So I kind of like being in the routine. I like, kind of like knowing what's coming next rather than just having just wandering around the, the day aimlessly waiting to go to the gym. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's nice, I needed the break. I was a little overwhelmed. I've been working pretty much every day since February. So only in September I got the break and now I'm ready to uh, like to go back, gung-ho. My brain needs the, the rest as well, you know? It's nice to, to get up and not have to do anything. I don't wanna keep doing that, but it's definitely nice. I'm, re I'm ready to go back, basically. That's a long way of saying that. But i um, very happy with the workout. Uh, let's see, what else did I do? So what did I get with the 15s? I think I got 13 reps, 12 or 13, with the 115s. So I think I'll be going up to 120s on that. And then I might be sticking to whatever that second, second uh, set weight was which was 85. Yeah, I think I'll stick. So I'm gonna go 120 and then 85 for the second set. Yeah, really happy. My posing, honestly, I think this was the best posing I've ever done this week. Now granted, it wasn't monumental better. It was slightly better. I like how I'm, my, my foot is kind of tilted in to kind of show off the calf. I've never been thinking about what my calves look like. So I've been definitely focusing on that, on, on, on all the poses that I have my calf being uh, shown. So those are like the side poses. And uh, stretching went very well. Very happy with the stretching. And uh, I really have nothing else to say. So I think I'll end it here. Thank you very much for watching. And I think tomorrow is gonna be, if, if today is any indication, tomorrow is gonna be a very good leg day, specifically on the hack squats. So thank you very much for watching. And until next time, peace.